Hey, hey, wish hey, we had hey. more ship codes. I do too. <laughs> you ruined my joke. Damn it. Leave uh, Albert out of this. Hey, hey, guys. Welcome back to Borderlands. <laughs> I don't have any intro. I don't care. Uh, we are actually now starting the fight for Sanctuary, which neither of us have done. At all. And after... Yep. Then after this, it's either Tiny Tina's or, or Borderlands 3. 3. Granted, we might just record something completely different before that, but still. In terms of Borderlands, it's one of those two. Jack hasn't even a hands up. Oof. You ready? Yep. Spoilers ahead! Hello, old friend. Been a while, hasn't it? <laughs> I bet you're wondering what became of our vault hunts. Let me tell you a story. After the death of Handsome Jack and the fall of Hyperion, Pandora was at peace. As much as it ever was. <laughs> Their mission complete, the Crimson Raiders set their sights beyond the stars. You remember the vault key, right? It had that map with all the crazy floating holograms. The vault hunters believed it would take them to vaults across the galaxy. Of course, sometimes when you're busy looking forward, you forget to watch your back. understand why we haven't left Pandora yet. We're nowhere closer to finding the vaults. This map is the most important scientific discovery in all of human history, and Mordecai is using it as a coaster. Does that matter? We don't even know which planets these are yet. I don't like flying blind. Sanctuary's holding together using spit and wishful thinking. She's barely staying in the air, let alone leaving the planet. We gotta do something. People are talking about disbanding the Raiders, and Pandora don't need us now that Jack's gone. We need a leader. She don't want the job, man. And can you blame her? Sometimes when you're the one calling the shots, people get hurt. Not making a choice is still a choice. So then, we have no plan, no working ship, no leader, and a soda can on the vault key! Lil, we need to make a call. What do you think? Ellie? That ain't the engines, Lil. This is Lilith. Sanctuary is under attack. All civilians evacuate the city immediately. Crimson Raiders, to me! Who can it be now? One down, a lot more to go. Alrighty, bitches. Ah, let go. This is our home. Push him out. Necromancer, angry. These guys. New Pandora. Yeah, who the fuck are these guys? What the fuck is going on?
to the vault key. <sighs> Lilith, there's too many of these pendejos. This is Lilith. All Crimson Raiders, fall back to HQ. Just tell me where to point this, some bitch. Come on. Time to change the world. Whose soul is this? <laughs> Whose soul is this? Time. I knew that son of one still on that thing. Hope you had your shot. You all right, killer? Let's just I got as many people off sanctuary as I could, yeah. but it was kind of a rushed job. Looks like I scattered the Crimson Raiders around the area. Those weren't bandits that attacked us. They were trained soldiers. And that gas, it turned people into monsters. Find us a base camp while I look around for the others. One dollar. We'll rally the troops and take back Sanctuary. So those were level 30 and 35s. 29 to 35. These cowards. This is Colonel Hector of the new Pandora Army. You can stop running now. I already got what I wanted. Sanctuary and the vault key are mine once again. <laughs> Honestly, I was hoping for more of a fight. I mean, yo got completely outmaneuvered. What happened to you, Crimson Raiders? Seems without your man rolling, you all turn into a pack of baby rats with your tail barbs tucked between your talons. <laughs> so here's what happens now. You've seen what my paradise gas did to your people. Next up, all the Pandora. Sure, it'll kill everyone on the planet, but every garden needs its fertilizer. Well, he's a dickhead. But he's right. Roland never would have let this happen. You know, back in the day, Sanctuary was the pride of Dahl's mining fleet. Seems to have fallen into disrepair. I hope you don't mind, but I've already made some upgrades. Here, I'll say it for you. Incoming. This is my kingdom! Squatter's rights! Bro! Those vine freaks are back! Okay, okay, who's saving me? Oh my god, I know who it is. Anyone who's not gargling vine currently, scream bloody murder! To hell with the first law! Jesus Christ. Anyone? You recognize the voice? No. Spider? Rudiger? He's Mama from... Panstein? Scratchy Scratch. Oh, not you too. The beginning of three. You were the toughest one of all. Captain I Underwear? I do not remember. Seriously, I have not played three in a while. Neither have I, but I remember that voice. Yeah, I don't. I don't have the best voice recognition, and you know that. I hear the sounds of bloodthirsty murder, and I love it. Whoever you are, mystery bandit, kill, kill, kill those fine freaks, and turn that tide. Hey, how's that tide coming? Is it still turning? Heck yeah! Slice and dice those reaping creepers, my mysterious savior. Ooh. Nice job. Ridonculus. Ooh. 
Doink. Now I'm sitting in some sort of clown theme novelty bar, enjoying weak old pizza and watered down booze. It's a hell of a lifestyle, folks, but it makes you soft. Rainbow I Runner. Experience an army rocks from the top down. What's I let that? my people up from ruin, gave them something to believe in. That's why they follow me. We are new Pandora. We're the men who split our backs on the promise of paradise, but it was stolen from us. Now we're taking it back, starting with your ship and your key. Now paradise is coming, and if I have to choke the life out of every last person on this planet to get there, then that's what I'm gonna do. Nashy. I thought it was supposed to be higher level than this from what I read. But you want to play the people who said that specifically never played it on normal. Yeah. I can't believe you didn't remember Vaughn. Easy, easy! <laughs> hey, let's not get all shooty at me, okay? Uh, my name is Vaughn. Uh, now we know we're supposed to be like, you know, mortal enemies or whatever, but I don't know, the enemy of my plant monster enemy, right? Sure. Hey, looks like Hector kicked you out of your home too, huh? Well, I guess we better join forces. Welcome to my camp, the back burner, huh? Look, Hector's mind freaks could be back at any moment. We better secure camp, Vault Hunter. The back burner's firewall got knocked out, and I'm talking an actual wall of fire. We gotta reset the security relays to get that firewall to flame in. You know, uh, I actually opened a vault once. Went from Hyperion accountant to vault uh, guy help, to guys. bandit war chief. It's a long but very touching story. <laughs> hey, I'll tell you about it sometime over some questionably sourced meat. Me and my bandit clan were living over in the wreckage of Helios Station, and Hector shows up and ordered us to give him our moonshot cannons, but we said, hell no, we won't, bro! And then that, that didn't work out too well. We tried fighting off Hector's new Pandora soldiers, but we were no match for him. I probably should have armed my clan with more than presentation-grade Hyperion laser pointers. <laughs> Lesson learned, I guess. Me and the survivors regrouped here. We were getting ready to retake Helios when heck nice! Now you can reboot the last relay. We'll have that old firewall of flaming in no time. And if any of my clan wow. survive, they'll come running when they see a fire. I they always death. do. It's hilarious. So what do you think of the DLC so far? They had moonshot cannons. Yo. And laser pointers. Something just ain't right about that uh, level of tech mixing. If Hector sends more vine freaks, we'll be ready for him. Thought it's one of those vine freaks! Kill it, stab it, shoot it! Sweet kill! Now, let's chat Blood Pact. Well, I never thought I'd team up with a filthy, smelly vault hunter like you, but desperate vine freak gas turning times call for desperate measures. Screw that home thief, Hector! You and I are gonna mess that dude up! Blood Pact! I ain't a real doctor. Haven't found anything good? My weapon machines will fix that for you. Next time you're bleeding to death, just think, Doc. What's up, killer? Good work finding a camp. I guess this will be our home while we figure out how to take back Sanctuary. Uh, this is my camp? Hey, Lil. Step <laughs> back if you don't want to get any bandit on you. Easy, easy! <laughs> we can share! Hey, want to take a spin in my lucky underwear? I'm listening. 
I'm gonna teleport back to Sanctuary and try to take Hector out. Maybe there's still time to fix this. Excuse me, you two! If you don't remember the fucking intro to Vaughn and Riddance. I can't get to free. Sanctuary's I don't. Tannis, can you, I don't know, whip us up an antidote? Of course. I will first need to discover the nature of these mutations. Send me some plant genitalia. I believe they are called flowers at your reading level. What she said. Oh. Let's get it done. He was hanging upside down in his lucky underwear when we found him in three. I vaguely remember that. I do not remember his name or voice, though, from three. I'm confused about the fact he's currently with Ellie mentally. I am dead Smoking. inside now. Take a spin in his lucky underwear. I blissed it. <laughs> like, what the fuck? I mean, <laughs> probably the first person who wasn't terrified of Ellie or trying to kill her. I mean, he's a bandit. What do you expect? <laughs> Granted, he's probably one of the most, one of the more lighthearted bandits out there. As I said, he's not terrified of her, and he's not trying to kill her like every other bandit. It's like bandit with two brain cells. The fuck's going on here? It's a fine day, full of opportunity. So you cowards teamed up with that bandit from Helios? Figures. They gave up their moonshot cannons real easy. Now I can launch my paradise gas wherever my eye can see. Adapt and reuse. That's called strategy. You know, if you ever want to taste victory for a change. I'm so ready to kill that guy. Get Tannis those samples, killer. I'll keep rounding up the raiders. Wait. Tannis, I couldn't find you after the attack. Let me. Oh, yes. I'm secure in one of my many hidden panic shelters. Handy when you live in a constant state of panic. Enough small talk. Get me those samples and we'll have a the plant monster army mine. of our own in no time. We just need an antidote. <sighs> Fine. Honestly, sometimes you people make no <laughs> sense whatsoever. That's what I picked up and went ooh about. Killer. I'll keep rounding up the raiders. Rainbow. Taste the rainbow, bitch. It's the rainbow, motherfucker. Ooh, texture glitching. You see that? No. The rocks are like flashing in and out color wise for me. Yeah, Over here. For me. Nope. It's like they were losing and gaining shadow rapidly. Where do we need to go for Zyklos? No, oh, but it's close. On the way. Really? Skags. I love how this thing looks and sparkles. Of course you do. It's a legendary skin. Why wouldn't I grab it? Is it Earl? It's Marcus. Unlucky roommates. But you, Van. Hey, that's my line. Get away from that dog. <laughs> uh, I thought I could handle living with this guy, but hey. What do you think you're doing? What you want? If I ain't got nothing, quit rubbing it in! Psst. Vault Hunter. I finagled a spot in Earl's bunker because I'm not messing around with crazy pants gas that turns people into plant monsters. But he doesn't have any food. You will assist me. Go get me some food, and you'll know you will be handsomely rewarded. <laughs> Okay, then. I want to know how Marcus ended up all the way out here with him in the first place. The Oddest cu Couple is actually an amazing fucking title for this because that is pretty out there.
had to get it from the other side, it seems. God damn it. Is it even safe to go in here? You might find yourself hitting harder while fighting within a gas pocket. Strange, but potentially helpful. Do keep a close eye on your exposure level. Unless sprouting vines and losing your mind is a newfound kink. In which case, I have some echo novels for your perusal. Judgment free zone. Look for closed bulbs. I need pure specimens. I see the gas has infected the local fauna as well. Vault Hunter, try obtaining samples from those infected skags. These mutated plants are enormous, even by Pandoran standards. It's unlikely that this gas is naturally occurring. Someone engineered it. <laughs> Oh my god. Mm -hmm. A loot nest! Start running, clowns! New monster! Um, but yeah, before you pick that up, look at it and read it. Moxie's Pizza, have you had a what lately? Let's go. Let me, uh... My accuracy sucks, so I can't read it because I'm Have you had a piece lately? Told you once, you your pizza so rolls. Bitch. How did a piece of broken ramen end up in my sock stabbing me? The world may never know. Did we get all the skags? I thought we needed one more kill on them. Found this couple and... We're not even boy. done here yet. There's another place like this that we can go to, you know? I forgot. Stupid gun. Designed to increase biomass at an exponential rate. In dumb speak, gas make tiny plant go big, big, and do the ouch. Understanding of advanced biogenetics, I can only describe as brilliant and arousing. Now we must discern how the gas is infecting humans. I will require samples. Specific, yes, yes, just as I suspected. I gained absolutely no information from those infected skags. The scientific method prevails again. Scientific method prevails again.
And wait for me. Well, it is an elevator. It will wait for you. I guess in the corner. At least you aren't counting. Oh my! Such playful MRMA structure. Tennis. <clears throat> yes, I will, as I say, keep my class by biohazard suit on. <laughs> Just a few more samples, boss hunter. I've almost reached a conclusion. Let me put weapons chest. Weapons chest isn't gonna kill you, is it? Not it's a not a mimic. It's all weird, like Nothing mimic like thing you. down there. Go back. Survivors. We have another quest to turn in. It is that way. Oh my god, the rocket's inaccurate. It's not flying straight. Please tell me the stacks are not affecting my actual in game gun. For the I think they are. That is horrible. I thought we had to get another thing for them. Did we? Mm-hmm. Find more food, okay. My car is all blinged and sparkly, yet I'm sitting here wearing le leopard print and fucking safari hat. Is Gage colorblind? Hmm. I may just be fashion blind. Mostly because my fashions just in include dark colors. <laughs> there goes a Goliath. got a point here. Right, you 
find way more food for Marcus. I do like the Wonderland grenades far better. Blaze's Tiny Tina's Wonderland grenades actually have a bit quicker tracking and fly a little quicker. Magic missile? Yeah. <laughs> short sleeves. God, must be hot wearing that out here in the sunlight. Why will no one play with me? Because that's why. Do you see the cactus past the vehicle? Do you see the body next to said cactus? Someone right here gets slingshotted straight forward to that cactus in the distance. And their body is laying next to it. I saw them fly over me. Oh, I see what we're supposed to do. I'll get the car. This is untenable. Untenable! Oh, look at the fancy man and his fancy words. What, you think you're better than me? I ain't thinking I'm no one. You're nothing but a capitalist pig dog. That's the nicest thing you've ever said to me. Wow. I'll just kill you and take your stupid bunk up. I heard that. You tried now eating your freaking hard force sauce beating. Pizza addicted skag. That should do for a while. Bring that to me. Where'd you put the cheese grater? Hmm? We don't even have any cheese. That's a sad point. What the hell is wrong with this guy? <laughs> Where'd you put the cheese grater? Why would Marcus even move the cheese grater? If there, <laughs> there's no cheese. God, I have a weird feeling that he is OCD. For him to notice the cheese grater was missing. Ah, girl, at least I won't starve. But now I need to protect my food from outsiders. And also Earl. Bring me a gun, something big like a rocket launcher to strike fear into the hearts of my enemies. And also, Earl. I ain't feared of nothing. Except cotton balls. Take them things! From his own vending machine. I hate this little whip pants cry, baby. I want out of this setup. You yeah? hear? Do me a solidify and beat up on one of his machines. <laughs> My poor baby machine. 
end of the world, blah, blah, blah. I've heard that before. All I know is, guys like Hector are great for business. I talked to him too soon and interrupted his panic. <laughs> ah, what's done is done, I guess. To be honest, I'm a bit relieved to be out of there. The whole place smelled like cat pee. But there were no cats. Besides, I can't stay mad at you. You're still my best customer. What the fuck? Look at him run. He was supposed to run towards the vending machine, I think, and I interrupted him before he could. Hey, thanks. Me, you're probably good for something. Also, leave me alone. Now that I got me some privacy, I gotta... Uh, things to do. Well then. There were chunks of it stuck on the car. What the fuck? The lichen pro. What have we gotten ourselves into? No idea. samples as soon as possible. I've made every preparation and completely disrobed so that there is nothing between me and the laboratory grade mylar of this biohazard suit. The sensation is very satisfying. Good to know she might like some BDSM gear. Just for the feeling of it. Slowly gets the water bottle. Oh, that's on me. Yeah, um, I was scanning my glutes for reasons, and uh, and I busted the science thing. <laughs> Just give it a little bandit high five. Scanning bio signature. Oh, I love that sound. Vault hunter, over here. Hey, Ned, Moxie. Tannis is working on an antidote. In the meantime, let's find a way oh, back up the sanctuary. Yo, Lilith! Me and Talon got a nice perch out by Mount Scarab. We might have found a way up to sanctuary. Mordecai! Good to hear from you. Uh, I wasn't gonna let you fight this one without me. Oh, crap! Brace yourselves! Bunch of Hector Salad soldiers are heading your way! Ellie, Hector Salad. What the hell? If you didn't know, in the Tales of the Borderlands game, Scooter died. Those things will fix anything with a few thwacks. I set up a badass choke point just outside of camp. Get them turrets humming, Vault Hunter. I because... did not know that.
This must have happened after the Tales of games. The very first one, I know that. Mm -hmm. And the second man, one apparently he... breaks the entire logic of all the stories, what people says. Yeah. The first one, though, was pretty good. And Scooter went out like a boss. but you totally fight like a bandit and that is the highest compliment Tannis any updates well I cannot produce an antidote but I have traced the gas to a scientist named Cassius Leclamad whoa Cassius I know that science dude I'm gonna call him now yo Cassius hey it's Vaughn Vaughn hello uh, I'm rather busy on a secret project gotcha gotcha Super quick question. Uh, did you plant Monster up my bros? I would never plant Monster up your bros. Hector swore that... Ah, oh, I see. I've been tricked into working for an evil megalomaniac. My bad. Hey, happens to the best of us, bro. Come to my secret laboratory. The entrance is through the old doll mine. I'll begin working on an antidote immediately. I got eyes on the mine, Lilith. Let you know if I see anything. I'm sorry, something about that was way too fishy. Why would he be like immediately like, oh, I've been duped? Is he just like way too buddy buddy with Vaughn? I guess so. Does he know like Vaughn would never lie to him or something? That's why that was said. Uh. 